Husbandos and Mike News, welcome back to another reaction review of the strongest exorcist. Wait, the reincarnation of the strongest exorcist in another world. Go, oh, man, I forgot the title in my brain a little bit. I'm, I'm still tired. Now, in the last episode, I asked you guys, what is an anime that you guys would always go back to and rewatch? We're going to go with IV. They said, for some reason, my go-to anime to rewatch is Konosuba. I just really enjoy the show and the characters. Believe it or not, next season in like a week or two i don't remember i think in two weeks we are going to get the konosuba Magumin series which i will be covering so i hope you guys are excited for that no question of the day just wanted to give my appreciation and thank you guys so much for supporting me and covering this series i know it's a little bit different i went full isekai trash as you guys know nonetheless thank you guys so much for the support i hope you guys uh, will continue to support me if you just started watching me because of the series and uh hope you guys enjoy the isekai trash role that we are going to partake in and whatever happens from here on out also check out my vlog at anime impulse if you guys missed that which is why last week's episode was a little bit late if you guys missed that upload i don't think he wants government deployment he wants this adventure with uh with amyu yeah he does not care about that because he was offered a job position with the knights and he turned it down and i love that this the 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 principal knows that Seika is is not no normal student, but he wants to keep that normal student status. So she recognizes that. So yeah, he still has plans as an, an adventure with Amyu. He says that now, act a little normal, but we all know some shit about to go down. Normal people can't do that. And I appreciate that she's kind of looking out for Seika. She knows that Seika wants to do things differently. And she's looking out for Seika. So I appreciate her existence. <laughs> Very true. He is involved. He's like Batman, dude. It's like, uh, it's like, um, Eminence in the Shadow. But people are going to be like, not as good as Eminence in the Shadow. Which, you know, fair. Oh, are they going to start the attack now? These demons or whatever they are? They are demon kind. That's going to be crazy because I feel like Seika's going to literally destroy every single person here. They're planning to slaughter all of the students. I I mean, I get it. There's a war between demons and humans, but I feel like even killing a child no matter what is so cowardly, bro. They say that now, man. Overconfidence, bro. It's so interesting to hear like the demon side of things because usually they would be just ready to kill, but they're just excited, you know, to be working together to get their mission done. Just like any normal human would. I mean, they, their mission is to kill. Wait, did Seika already predict this to happen? Dude, they gotta be careful with the fog. It might be fart, dude. It might give you conjunctivitis. Dude, I'm sorry. Conjunctivitis has been a running thing in this chat. Oh, damn, don't tell me she into bunny boys. Because she's blushing and your heart, too. It's unfortunate that their long journey is going to end fairly soon. I have this weird feeling because remember that last demon-ish encounter that Seika had to deal with the human that was working with the demons and how brutal that was? I have a feeling this one's going to be pretty, pretty crazy. <laughs> it's making these these uh these demons look like they're the main protagonists of this whole thing. It's like some on some overlord type of stuff. Huh? It's paper. It's the paper. My sturdy club has been damaged. <laughs> hey! Mabel's out here to frick someone up. Sheesh. It's been a while since we've seen Mabel in action too. Her strike is so heavy, but she's so agile. <laughs> the use of gravity magic, which is crazy. Oh, he's so strong. That's tough. Ah, oh, Seika dipped. Seika dipped her. There's the the leader, the captain. Yeah, everyone's here. Yeah, Seika knew they were coming. He prepared them. <laughs> He's just dead! 
Oh my gosh, he's ready to just destroy them. Yo, that guy is stunned. I wonder if he knows he has tied to the demon kind. Oh, it's already starting. What? Oh my God, bro. Bruh. Powerful enough to stop your heart. An aged viper. Oh, everything. Oh, shit. All his comrades be dead. They have to dip. He has to dip if he wants to survive. The Demon King! <laughs> Yo! The reveal? Oh my god bro yo that's crazy i need this as this is this this whole presence of what this looks like is nuts she's got me protecting her the most terrible demon king has joined the side of the humans <laughs> wait why does, Seika, why does it seem like Seika knows damn this man has to go all out on his first attack to just die <laughs> I feel like this guy's gonna die bruh so he just died either way <laughs> oh dude she's concerned oh dude she has a pure heart He says that's so calm. Like, I dealt with it. <laughs> Don't tell anybody. <laughs> so they're just going to disregard that there's, like, a bunch of blood and all that stuff, like, out in the open like that? Or did Zeka, like, clean it up? <laughs> yeah, she didn't seem nervous. She just said whatever she wanted. Yeah, because she cares about being a student and hanging out with Seika and everybody. Oh, she actually had a great speech <laughs> compared to, like, I came here to only get stronger. <laughs> what? What did you do? Demon Emissary? Demon Emissary? No, 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 no. What? What? That's where it ends? Yeah! That's where it ends? Okay, okay, this has 13 episodes. Okay, this has 13 episodes. Okay. I was gonna say, bro. Holy, bro. Holy. I, th I, th I really thought that's. Th I thought I really thought this was a season finale. Ooh, I was gonna say that's where they ended off. That's some bullshit. <laughs> okay, so a lot has been revealed. I mean, we already knew that Seika was like the son of the Demon King or the Demon Lord. So in that sense, now that he's with the human side and he is like so much stronger than everyone else, puts a lot of stress into the demons. And they, they just like, oh my God, the worst thing could possibly happen. The Demon King is on the other side protecting humans. I mean, I'm in a way, I feel like Seika's not going to give up his own personal humanity just because he is what he is. And and, um, what's his name? What's, what's the little fox girl name? It seems like she knows that Seika's different. That's why she was terrified. She's like, uh, you're able to do all of this without this and that. It's scary. And, like, she, her intuition is very, very on point. Because Seika's strength is a little different than most. Even his magic is different than most people here. But the fact of how powerful he is instills fear into the demons. He, it seems like humans can't really sense much. If the demons can sense that type of power, they know that it's a threat. He he literally just cut off one guy's head. He sliced up Gulganis or whatever his name is, bro. He destroyed everyone that pulled up. Everyone just died. It was so anticlimactic for them because they thought they were going to go in and mess things up. But no, they just died instantly. It was It's quite unfortunate for the, the, the demon side. Even though it, it felt like half of this episode was, that, was gassing them up like, we're going to do this together. We're finally going to complete our mission. This is all what we work hard for. We went on this long journey as friends blah 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 just to get bodied bro all in all man this, this was a 
Fair, not brutal episode. I thought it was gonna be more brutal. I mean, obviously it was brutal in terms of like they just died, but it was just fast. <laughs> they just died instantly. Now I'm curious to see where this Amu situation is going to go. Luckily, there is 13 episodes. Thank goodness. So I want to see if Amu is gonna be all right. But nonetheless, guys, let me know your thoughts about this episode in the comment section below. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Yeah.